Alrighty, my fine wheel horse folks. Um, okay, so I took the starter solenoid off of my uh, 1976 D160, okay? Just to see what was all going on here. And it just wasn't grounding right, and this is why. So it looks like somebody took a piece of aluminum something and bent it into shape to try to work. And then they didn't put a second screw in there so yeah but anyways i'm just gonna go ahead and probably go get a new one um and keep this one as a backup if i have to but anyways this wire was attached onto this terminal and then i'm gonna guess that it goes in that second hole right there uh, and there's no screw in there. This is for the safety switch for the pedal. So I have it unhooked. But but uh, anyways, I just want to make sure that that wire, this one, I'm going to do better connections. I'll probably just run a new wire. This wire goes on to that post on the safety switch. Okay, that's my first thing. And then my second thing is I accidentally undid this top wire and this bottom wire. And um, how can I make sure before I start this up after I put a new solenoid on that I plug those into the right spots? I know the blue one for sure. I remember and I know it goes in the middle and that's... It didn't come unplugged anyways, but I just want to make sure that I plugged these two in correctly and I don't want to fry anything. So, um, somebody help me out there. Tell me what I need to do to test that to make sure. Um, and then that's pretty much it. I'm going to clean that up where that bracket bolted. That's pretty crusty. And then get some new bolts. And these were the bolts holding the bracket on for the safety switch so a couple of new bolts new solenoid should be back in uh, business so thanks for the help everybody I appreciate it I know I'm kind of annoying sometimes but that's how I learn so I don't want to trial and error <laughs> electrical because sometimes that can uh, backfire as we all know so thank you very much